Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Lanky Woodsman. Today I'm going to be doing a review and rating of the K-Bar Mule. This particular version is in zombie green and I've been carrying this on and off in my EDC for the last two years. Specifications on this uh, folding knife are the steel is OS 8A stainless, the blade is 3.87 inches. The overall length when opened is 9.125 inches and the edge that the blade comes with is a 15 degree angle. The, blade, the knife is made in Taiwan and the blade thickness is 0.125 inches. The handle scales on this knife are Zytel but it also has these black lines which are actually rubber that stick out so grip is not a problem. Very easy to hold on to with those rubber rubber lines. Uh, we have a hollow grind which is very nice. The 15 degree blade edge was a little bit weak. I changed mine to 20 degree and I haven't had any issues since then. Um, one thing I can show is the sharpness of this blade even after use. Very sharp. Um, what I can say about the knife is that I have used this EDC cardboard plastic pretty much the same as my other EDC knives and this particular one is one of my favorites. The only downside to this one is the size. It's pretty large um, but I love this knife. Um, I can wear it with jeans and certain dress pants um, without you know bringing attention to myself but the the clip is actually pretty pretty decent as far as uh, deep pocket carry so it's not not noticeable in your pants um, and it does come with a nylon sheath which I cannot find right now I don't wear it with a sheath um, but it's velcro and it actually allows for horizontal or vertical carry. Um, not sure what I've done with that but I'll go ahead and try to find a picture of that and put it in the video. Um, I chose the zombie green mainly because I thought it was a decent color and it was actually way cheaper than the black at the time. You can find this on Amazon right now for about $40. I'll put a link in the description. Overall the blade is definitely strong. It's very easy to sharpen and it holds its edge for an okay amount of time. Um, I don't really have any negatives about this. It has some jimping at the top here that isn't overly aggressive. It could probably be a little more aggressive but it's it's fine for what this thing does. I love the knife. I definitely recommend the knife and if I were to rate this on a scale of 1 to 10 I would give this a 7.5. Sharpness is there, the comfortability is there, the durability is there. I love the the lockback system. Um, very reliable. I've never had any issues with this thing closing. There's no no wiggle up or down or left to right on this blade, and this has seen a lot of usage. Um, the coating that's on here, I'm not sure what it is, but it's holding up pretty well. There's a few scratches here in the front, but that's to be expected because I beat this thing up. So, that is my rating and review of this blade. I will definitely put those links in the description so you can pick one of these up. And hopefully I can get that picture of the sheath in there for you guys. And as always guys, please like the video, share the video, put some comments in the comment section so I can interact with you, and I will see you in the next one.